What up everybody, welcome to Audio Suite and this video is about getting your beats cleaned up as much as possible before you send it out for mixing and mastering which is a critical step that anybody in this game shouldn't want to overlook because a bad mix can directly affect your sales I mean when artists are looking for beats they're going to be able to tell right away who's inexperienced and who's not and one of the quickest ways to, to spot that inexperience is through a bad mix so I'm going to be showing y'all how to clean up your mix before you send it off for mixing and mastering to get you a, a couple steps closer to that industry sound of which we all looking for. So here's a beat that I made uh, real quick for this tutorial. Uh, let's check it out. just a simple loop you know real real simple real catchy but um this is how we should go ahead and go about doing it um i assigned every instrument to an individual track on the mixer i'm assuming y'all know how to do that if not that's a separate video um but we'll just start from here i jump right into it i start with the kick and i'll roll off all the way down about 600 hertz because all of this extra energy or all of these extra frequencies on the high end we're not using so let's cut it out it just cleans up the, the mix a lot more same thing with the, 80, with the 808 about 400 hertz got the hi-hats now we gonna roll it off all the way up to about 4k I got two high hats and the same thing about this one too about 4k Just a couple other things to make sure of too when you're sending it off. Um, make sure that none of your signals are clipping. Make sure nothing is in the red. Um, a distorted signal. There's not much you can really do with a distorted signal. So these are things to look out for. Green, yellow is there. That's cool. Yeah, these are all good. Um, and another thing that a lot of people forget is to disable all of the plugins that you may have on the master bus. So, you know, this limiter here is deactivated, but a lot of people leave compressors and limiters on the master bus and they send it off to be mixed and it's not much you can really do, you know. So these are just some things that 
that we could do to make sure we get your beats one step closer to that perfection industry radio sound. And and that's pretty much it. Visit the website, www.audiosweetproductions.com, and go ahead and get your beats mixed today. Peace.